Welcome everybody, this is your boy Joanna Matero and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash the like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Crazy Boss V31, Weez GNZ Gaming, Moldy Superman YT, Foxy, and even Dirty. Now, these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform, and I really do appreciate their support. So, why don't you go inside my description below and go and check them out? And we're going to get straight into the video now this video is all about on how to install the single player garage mod inside your grand theft auto v folder so like always make sure that you do download this mod and i will leave this mod inside my description below don't forget to download enable all interiors and i will leave this inside my description below as well now this mod does require lemon UI so I will leave this inside my description below as well so make sure that you do download lemon UI so once you have finished downloading all of your requirements all you gotta do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game hover over it right click and open file location now next go to your scripts folder make sure that you do spell scripts correct and make sure it is all lowercase open up your scripts folder now first things first open up your lemon ui extract folder then go to your shvd2 folder select all the files and drag it inside your scripts folder then now go to your shvd3 folder this is optional and now select all the files and drag it inside your scripts folder. Now exit out of your extract folder. Now next, open up your enable all interiors extract folder, also known as EAI. And now all you gotta do is select all the files and folder, except for the text files, and drag it inside your scripts folder. Now exit out of your extract folder. Now lastly, open up your SPGR extract folder, go in this folder and this folder, select all the files and folders except for the text file and then drag it inside your scripts folder. Then that's all you got to do. Exit out of your extract folder. If this pops up, just go to replace. Exit out of your extract folder. Go to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click, refresh your game folder, exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I'll see you guys in the game. And now we are in the game, and now our game did not crash. So when you're in the game, okay, there's a few things that you must do first, and you'll need to enable all interiors. So go to your phone, go to contacts. And now go right down to the bottom to enable all interiors. Now you can enable the interiors, okay? Just do whatever you want. But the really important one is to go to the MISC options. Then go to load MP maps. Change that to true. And change enable blips to true. Now this next step is optional. But change the color blips to true. Back at one, then go down and now refresh interior. Wait for a few seconds. And now, lastly, go on your keyboard and press insert. Now, your game will freeze for only a few seconds. Just wait. And now your game will load. Now, I forgot to mention, okay, guys, you will need to go to your scuttlev.net and now change the reload key to insert, okay? So you make sure you do that first. So let's just get straight into the game. Now, to buy a garage, you'll need to go there, okay? Um, okay, where's the garage? 
He's a garage here. So we're gonna go over there and buy a garage. And now we are at this location, okay? And this is the location for the garage, okay? Now I have already brought the garage, okay? Because I was just testing it, but when you go to the circle, okay, you need to buy the garage. Now, unfortunately, like I said before, I already bought it. So you need to buy the garage. And I say press E to save the record or Q to go inside the garage. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a yeah, I don't have a car, but just only press Q to enter the garage, and now you can go over here. So, this is your garage, and over here, you can just come over here, and now press E, to, and now you can sell your vehicle, or whatever you want, okay? Or remove all vehicles, or add a vehicle in the slot. Uh, this one over here, uh, this one, and now there it goes, and now... You yeah, it's pretty cool. See, the, the vehicle is over here. Now you can just jump in your vehicle, press F. Now, T, now press E to use this vehicle. And now you can just drive around. And if you want to go back in the garage, you can. All you got to do is just go over here and press Q. And now just go back inside here. And now your car is back in here. See? So that's how you guys use the mod and that's how you install it. And welcome back everybody. So I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. But like always, if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Or if you do get stuck installing any other mods, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that as well. And if you guys do need fast reply, then I will leave my Discord server inside my description below. I'm always active on my server. So make sure that you do join my Discord server. And make sure that you do verify the PC modding support area. So like always, if you guys did enjoy this video. Or if this video was helpful. Then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I will see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace, and I'm out.